Hey Scorpio, how's it going? How are you guys doing? If this is your first time checking out Truly Divine's channel. What is up? I am Amy. If you are returning, welcome back. Hope you guys are doing fantastic. So something new for my channel, but I decided I was going to do pre little quick messages for you guys. So this is pre September messages just to see what I'm getting myself into for September. Um, so very interesting for you guys to say the least. So I'm not going to keep you. So let's just dig into this right off the hop. Spirit is coming through and saying you guys need to go in hermit mode right now or you guys will be or you need to or something on a lot of that. But here's what I'm hearing. You need to go into hermit mode because you need to really think about something. I feel like maybe you've got a situation. Maybe you met someone and now you two aren't talking or you're not communicating and you're in this place of like, I don't know what to do. I can't get this person off my mind. I don't know. what Like, should I stay? Should I go? Should I communicate? You're just in this place. And I feel like you have so many people around you right now that are doing this. And so your mind is going like this. And I feel like Scorpio, you can't think about anything right now because you've got so many things going on in your brain that you can't focus at all. You don't know what Scorpio wants. So spirit's kind of saying like, you need to go into hermit mode and ask yourself like what it is that you want, not your mom, not your dad, not your friends, not your family, not, not your neighbor, not your doctor. Like what does Scorpio want? Um, it's, it's a healing period for you guys, or it will be coming into December. But I feel like for whatever reason, I'm really feeling this need for you guys to go within yourself because the answers are within yourself. Again, they're not from any outer source. I mean, it's okay to get an opinion. I'm not saying go get opinions, but I'm saying your final decision should be of yours, not anyone else's Scorpio. All right. I feel like you guys are just in this place right now where it's like, you're constantly taking on burdens you're constantly um carrying a lot of responsibilities or you feel like everything going on in your life right now is your responsibility i feel like you're worrying a lot you're worrying about everything and you feel like everything is on you i don't know why i feel that way but i do i feel like if it's like work related like all the work responsibilities are on you it's like the relationship you have to be the one that communicate like it just feels like everything is on you and i feel like you're a freaking ticking time bomb right now that's what I feel, Scorpio. It's like you're you're about to explode because you have just so much going on in your mind right now. And it's like you can't think for yourself. Um, you're in fight mode. It's like with a ticking time bomb. I feel like especially with the five of wands, it's like you're in this place of like, all right, you know what? I, I'm ready to battle. I'm ready to fight. I'm ready to go. You know, and you're not even thinking of it. It's just you're so elevated right now that it's like you're so up here. And spirit wants to get you down here, get you mellow so you can think. But it's like you're so up here right now. And it's like, how do you how do I find common ground? All right. Because you're in this place of being like, you know what? I'm going to have my defenses up. I'm going to have my wall up. I'm going to have a temper with everyone. I'm going to be mad at the world. And I'm just going to fight anything that comes my way. Because I'm carrying too much. I'm worrying too much. And I'm listening to other people. Instead of listening to my own advice. So this is interesting. We have the King of Swords and we have the Knight of Swords, guys. So this is what it's telling me. Is that... This is definitely some type of situationship, relationship, whatever you want to call it. You met someone, you guys connected, and then for whatever reason, it's like you pulled back, they pulled back, and now there's no communication whatsoever. Yet, even though you both want to communicate, I'm telling you, this person's thinking of you and you're thinking of this person, but because you're listening to other people in your ear tell you, well, you shouldn't be with this person or blah, 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 or they're listening to other people, it's like you two are detached right now. You're there's something blocking you guys from coming back together. And I think it's this third party energy, or maybe it's you working too much or they're working too much. But I do feel like there's communication coming, whether it's a text or an email. So just be cautious of that. But I do feel like someone's kind of sitting there, especially with the King of Swords, kind of sitting there like, should I text? Hmm, no. And then the next day it's like, should I text? Yeah. And then it's like, or you get out your phone and it's like, you go to send a text message, but for whatever reason, you just erase it. I don't know why I'm getting this, but that's what I'm feeling guys. So I'm hoping it resonates with you. Moving on. I feel like we're going into the star card. So this is about hope. This is about spirit coming down and saying, you know what? You may be frustrated right now. You may be worrying. You may be mad at the worlds, but you're going to get through this. You're going to be okay. The waiting is over. You're going to figure it out. You're going to get closure. You're going to have a completion, especially with the world card here. All right. Huh. So stop worrying, stop stressing, go within yourself, know that everything that's going to happen is going to happen for a reason. And everything that is breaking apart, it's just, it's going to be okay, cancer. 
or cancer. I mean, Scorpio. Oops. <laughs> all right. So all this stuff that you're stressing about, just give it time. Let things unfold. All right. See you guys next time. Well, I'll see you guys at the beginning of September. Take care.